Hi friends! Five ways to support your creativity. I feel like a lot of us think that creativity just comes to us and we're just hit or struck by the lightning bolt of creativity and it's something that we don't really have to work towards. It's just something that happens to us. Um, but from my experience, if I wait for that, then it kind of never comes. Um, and you kind of have to hold space for and create the like conditions for creativity to be able to thrive. I wanted to share with you, I created this short list of five ways to support your creativity. Yay! I'm just going to dive right in. The first way that you can support your creativity is by creating a routine or a ritual or a habit around it. Something that is a repeatable, consistent time that you set aside to do something creative, whether it's five minutes, an hour, a day, a way that I'm able to make space for and ensure that I have like creative time is when I actually put it on my calendar and turn it into something that's a regular thing. And also, I want to say I'm not perfect at any of these. I know that these things work for me, but that doesn't mean that I always, like, stick to them because I'm a human and things happen. And, like, same for you. If you miss a week or a day or whatever, like, it's not the end of the world. Um, you can always pick it back up. Don't beat yourself up. Because beating yourself up really doesn't help anything. It just makes you feel worse. Number two is create a space for your creativity. So that kind of goes along with creating a routine around your creativity. So the routine is a time space. This space that I'm talking about is like a physical space. So whether that's I have this like little desk and that's my creative desk, or it might be you have a whole room if you have the privilege of having that kind of space. That is like the dedicated space for my creative stuff. If you don't have physical space like a desk or a room, you could also create temporary physical spaces for your art. To set that space and turn it into that dedicated space, you could add some kind of ritual to it. You like get a cup of tea and light a candle. When you do that, your brain is like, oh, I know what we're about to do. We're going to be creative because this is what you do every time you're creative. When I do these things together, that means that like the space is for creativity. The third way to support your creativity is to <laughs> set a timer and do something, anything. Whatever your creative thing you want to work on is, do like five minutes of that. No one is perfect 100% of the time. Like that just doesn't exist. Sometimes we just need to give ourselves a space to like make a bunch of shitty art. Let the perfection go out the window because that's not important. It's the act of doing it. When you do it, it's more likely that you're going to get something that you like because you're doing it instead of not doing it. <laughs> The fourth way that you can support your creativity is having your supplies in an easy to see and easy to reach place. Make it really easy on yourself so that as soon as you feel the creative urge, then you can just be like, I got it. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> the fifth and final way to support your creativity is to have an accountability buddy. Just having a friend that you can talk to about it and to remind you or support you or encourage you through doing this thing is really helpful. You could do a co-working or body doubling session with someone or a group of people. And co-working and body doubling, to me, I kind of use them interchangeably. But it's basically having a set day and time where you and one or more people get together virtually or in person to do your own work individually, but in the same space. Just having another person working alongside you on their own stuff is a lot of encouragement and accountability for you to also do whatever your stuff is. Yay! So that's the five ways to support your creativity. And I'm going to go through those again really quickly. So here's the list. Five ways to support your creativity. Create a ritual, routine, or habit around it. Um, have a dedicated space for your creative project or idea or thing. Um, set a timer and do something, anything, even if it's like five minutes. Uh, get an accountability buddy or coworker or body double and store your supplies in a place that's easy to reach and see so that you can use them in a pinch really quickly. Yay! Creative things! If you liked this, please let me know. I'll put the link to my survey below and you can let me know what kinds of things you want to hear from me. Have fun being creative. Support your 
art dreams. I love you so much. Thank you for being here.